Welcome back to a, another episode of Know Your Tools. I know I've been gone for a minute, but today we're going to take a look at um, a request from Elaine Gamer on the forums. We're going to talk about pack build. Um, thanks for being patient. I have a lot of stuff to do in real life, but it's good to be back. And we're going to take a look at pack build today, how to unpack and kind of how to pack your files and actually talk about when not to pack your files. And um, there's some things I don't remember about it. I don't use it in my mod because my mod isn't that big. If it starts getting like terribly big, I might pack it. But because I don't have so many leaders, it works pretty well. Um, I think I remember that if you don't pack it, it could affect and help speed up your game in game. But I'm not sure about that. If I can find that out, I'll post it on the forum. In the meantime, though, uh, it does, if you pack your art files, it helps you um, speed up your loading time at the start. So let's talk about the advantage. The advantage is it speeds up loading time, and it helps keep them all together. What are the disadvantages? They're harder to get to because they're packed up. If you want to just change one little thing, you have to unpack it or... You have to delete the old one and repack it from your source files. So, um, it's handy and it speeds up loading time. I'm not sure about in-game. Again, I'm going to look that up. I tried to find it before this, but I decided to just record the video. So, let's talk about um, pack build. Alright, first thing we're going to do is... Uh, find out where to download it so on sif fanatics there is this thread but i could not get um this is posted by thunderfall who's the administrator of sif fanatics but i couldn't get the links to work however you can just download it here which i'll put a link to in the description but also you can find it at the download section under utility programs and you can use this not just to unpack, like he says, but also to pack it. So it's handy. Um, you just go straight here, and you can pack it. All right. So let's take a look at it. We're going to go to pack build. All right. Pack build is actually uh, mostly simple. There's just a few settings, and don't panic all right first thing we're going to do is look at how to unpack because i think that's more useful because you may run into someone who packs something and you want their art files but you find out they're in a pack so it's dot fpk um that's one i used before let's go here program files Hold on. 2K for Axis. All right, so if you go to the basic files, you can click any of them we want. So all you do is press unpack. Then we're going to put them in a folder. Uh, you pick where you want them to go. So we'll put ours in our current tutorial, which would be the packing tutorial. Okay. Now you gotta wait a minute for it to unpack. If you want all the vanilla files, they split them into four. Now you can split them. I'll talk a little bit about that in a minute. But if you want to unpack them all, you need to unpack all four. And there's different stuff in each of them. Or you can combine them all, which is what I did. Um, after I unpack them all, put all the things that are in the leaderheads folder, in the leaderheads folder, units with units, etc. One thing you don't want to pack is movies, and it actually I'm finished, so let's go look at that. Oh, well, I overrode my uh, other folder I had ready, but it won't take long to fix it. Okay, anyway, blah, blah, no big deal. 
Uh, so what this did is it unpacked all the art, DDS files. I think there are NIFs in here. Yep. But see, like some of them are partial. Here's the airport. It's one file. Because the way they did it, they didn't do it in sections. They just did, I'm not sure how they did it on the vanilla game. But most people just use one. Uh, you could use multiple. I'm not sure of the advantages. The main thing we're here to talk about is unpacking and how to pack it simply. Again, do not pack movie files. That won't end well because it won't work. All right. So all you do is unpack and pick a place. Super easy. Next, we're going to delete that because I already have them unpacked. and I don't need them. And also... We were going to do another, now we're going to do packing. We're just going to pack a tiny little, sure, we'll pack the Middle Earth mod. I haven't done that before. Uh, all I have is interface, leaders, structures, terrain, and units. I have no movies in mind, so we're going to go. What you want to do is copy it and put it somewhere else. We're going to put it in this same one. Because here's what you need. You need a folder, kind of like a dummy folder, above it, a parent folder. Because if you try to pack a... Yeah, this is going to take a minute. <laughs> if you try to pack um, things in just the art folder, it won't pack them correctly because it won't pack it under art. So what you need is a folder above art and only art in the folder. So make a folder, maybe on your desktop, maybe under your documents, and put your art in it just like this, copy and paste. We're currently pasting all of the Middle Earth mod, which I haven't done this before because I leave mine unpacked because I change it so often <laughs> and get, get these whims and be like, eh, I'm going to change that today. So I do recommend you keep a backup. And don't just pack it all in and then delete everything. <laughs> Bad idea. All right. Anyway, um, after should be done soon in about a minute. After you pack it, there's a couple settings you have to look at. Let's go ahead and look at them while we're waiting on it. Okay. You do not want it to be compressed. Do not check the compress box. You want to uncheck compression. I'm not sure how to use it. I am sure there's a way. But, from all the tutorials I've found, they recommend not to use it. You want to use the store full paths option. Alright, um, how's this looking? 85%. Alright. So, you want to use store full paths. This will allow you to correctly point at them like normal and you can still use capitalization you'll notice in the xml files when you point to an art folder that's in the the packed the fpk file they still use capitalization so it ignores capitalization civilization 4 does all right so now it's finished we've copied it over so you're going to go up here and click new and it'll bring up choose a folder so choose the parent folder do not choose the art folder choose the parent folder and make nothing sure nothing else is in there except art all right so we got this right here art now we're going to do not press compress all. Make sure you press store full paths. We use pack. And then this doesn't matter because we're not going to compress anything. <laughs> all right. So you can override your current ones. I don't know how that works. I recommend you keep a backup. Work from there. And fill existing pack files first. Uh, but if you want to create new pack, I recommend you just get rid of the old one and put a new one or archive the old one. It's probably a better idea. All right, so now 
We're going to press build. Now we wait. Now it will say not responding. Don't worry about it. It's goofy. It does that too when you unpack a really big file. This was just written by Firaxis. So just kind of chill. Wait for it to get done. This, as you can see, this is not very complicated. Basically, store full paths, choose a folder, make sure you choose the parent folder. That's it. So let's review. Um, when you're modding, you can use this to speed up load times. It does make it a little harder and you have to do more steps. I will find out if it slows down turn times a little bit. It might because it loads it from the pack file. It rearranges it. And you don't want it compressed because then it'll have to uncompress it. So don't do that. <laughs> um, if I find conflicting information or if you know it and you can like source it on the forums or stuff where people who know how to mod or if you know how to mod really well and you see something different or know something different about this, please let me know. And I'll change the video. I can actually put, I can put more on the end of the video later. All right, um, but just let me know. And so, again, you can use it. Do not pack movie files. Choose the parent folder and store full paths right here. All right, it's still, quote, unquote, not responding, but it acts like it's almost done. This thing is really piggy. It's really slow. I never use this. <laughs> I tried to use it one time and it was just too much of a hassle. But this is a tool that is available to you. So I have a, a decent amount of stuff in here. I don't have a ton of leader heads. Like some, some mods have tons of leader heads. Units, I have a good amount and that's growing. So I may consider this. Okay, this will tell you all the packed files. Needless to say, there are a lot, 356 megabytes. You can mess around with it. You can also open certain packed files, and you can save. I'm not sure what all of these things do, honestly, but that's how you unpack, and that's how you build at the most basic level. Um, thanks for watching. I hope that helps. If you have more questions, and I don't know the answers to them, Come to the forums, post, I'll try to find the answers, and I'm sure we can find somebody who does know the answers. There's lots of talented modders there. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.